Hey guys, today is January 30th, and it's time for the Steam Bills a week, so let's get started. Getting over it with Bennett Foddy is 50% off, making it $4. Very positive reviews overall. This is a very challenging game in which you use a hammer to climb up certain obstacles until you make it to the top. Now there is no saves, there is no progress really in this game, so if you mess up and you drop down, you're stuck there until you make it back up to where you were. So if you like extremely difficult games, then this one is for you. A Plague Tale Innocence is 60% off, making it $18. This is the historical low on Steam, I believe. Very positive reviews overall, and this is a story-rich adventure game. Now as far as adventure story games go, I think this is pretty good, tells a pretty good story. There's really good action in this game, and a little bit of history as well. Throne of Lies is uh, free for the next three days, or you can buy it for 60% off making it $4. This is kind of like Town of Salem in that vein, where it's like there's the Mafia, and then you have to discover who's the Mafia before they kill everyone and win. So very similar to Town of Salem. Uh, very positive views overall. You can play with your friends, it is multiplayer, and it is your decision if you like it better than Town of Salem or other styles of games like that. Spyro Reignited Trilogy is 50% off, making it $20. Overwhelmingly positive reviews overall. This is the 3D platformer that was on the original consoles, I forget what console it was, but it's totally remade with the new style, all scaled up, reimagined, and looks great. So if you've played the original, it's going to be pretty similar to the originals, but I don't even think you will recognize what you're playing. So $20 is pretty good for this price if you're into Spyro. Human Fall Flat is 60% off, making it $6. Very positive reviews overall. It's constantly updated. It's a physics puzzle game and extremely fun with friends. I've mentioned this one before, but I have to mention it again because it is that good. So that's it for this week's Steam Deals of the Week. Make sure to mention anything I missed down in the comments below, and thank you guys for watching.